Christmas is the birthday of Jesus. In the Philippines, we also observe Bonifacio Day, which is the birthday of Andres Bonifacio. We remember also the birthday of Jose Rizal. But have you not asked why on the birthday of Andres Bonifacio, we do not have an image of Catalina and Santiago, his parents, with a baby named Andres? Why don't we have a picture, an image, or celebrate the birthday of Jose Rizal by having a baby with Theodora and Francisco around the newly born baby. Why? Because we presume that heroes became babies. We presume that heroes were born, and when they were born, they were small like babies. How come we celebrate Christmas by remembering the Christ child and remembering Mary and Joseph? We remember how God became a child because this is extraordinary. God did not break through the clouds and said, I am here. God did not come from the ground magically and said, I am here. God did not split a tree and then said, I am here. No, God became a child and it is a surprise because even if he could come in an enchanted, magical way, he chose to come to us through the difficult way of being in the womb of a human being for nine months, of waiting for nine months to be born, of being wrapped in swaddling clothes, of being in the care of human beings, even if he created Joseph and Mary. That's awesome. That's wonderful. And it is a surprise because God showed his love for us by going through the difficulty of infancy and childhood. And all surprises are delightful. My dear brothers and sisters, that is why Christmas is a delight, because it is a surprise. We cannot presume that God has to be a child. He could have done it some other way, but He chose it in the most human, the most difficult way, so that He can become like all of us. We are men and women who love to be delighted. And how are we delighted? By a surprise. God surprised us by going all the way to show His love for us. Christmas is a surprise. You are not surprised that Andres Bonifacio became a baby. You are not surprised that Jose Rizal was once a baby. But be surprised that Jesus became a baby. And He became a baby to make it easier for us to carry Him, to make it easier for us to love Him, to make it easier for us to understand that He is fully human like all of us. Why? Only because He loves us. Only because He loves you.